a, he's a he's a guy that gets a lot of marks, Biskemoth is, and, and he hasn't had any marks in the first two frames. That is a window, in my opinion, for Serpico, who can also go out there and get a variety of marks, full circles, cherries, and he's proven this season uh, that he does have the hybrid game if he needs it. He's, he's gone fishing uh, a few times, um, but no need to bring the hundo in at all uh, right now. He needs to show Biskemoth that he is as good up the middle um, as Biskemoth is, and, and he's on pace right now for the first full circle this, in this match. Uh, full circle would be absolutely huge momentum-wise. And there it is. That's big. Absolutely. That's big. That why, is Eric, why is that big? It's, not, it's just a, it's a full circle. It's just a 36 points. The other guy got 34. Why is it so big? It's big for two reasons. One, because it shows Biskemoth that you're here to play some ski ball. Two, uh, whenever you start a sport, whatever, regardless of the sport, you, you know, you, you, you want to know that, that your game is at the ready. And in ski ball, you roll marks, fullies, cherries, chips, high fives, and fish. And uh, if it takes you a little while to pick up that first mark, you start questioning yourself. Is it there? Do I got it? Um, and so he gets a mark, a full circle in the second frame. And he's going to ride that into this match, no doubt about it. The first mark in a match, I believe, is the hardest one. And uh, Serpico broke the seal right there. But Schemith is on pace for a fully right now. Oh. And that rattles home. Okay. And it's one of those things as well. And, and this happens uh, in other games too. Um, you know, when your competitor starts to pick up the pace, it affects you uh, and, and, and helps you sort of, you know, find it and lock in. And I think that's what happened there. Serpico rolls that fully and Beskemoth took a deep breath and says, okay, let's do this thing. Match starts now.